Solve this system for x. Use the substitution method. x minus y equals 2, x times y equals 4. We're going to solve the first equation for one of the variables, and we're going to solve for y so that we end up solving for x first because we're asked to just solve the system for x. We don't need to find y. If we start with x minus y equals 2 and solve for y, we get y equals x minus 2. Substituting x minus 2 for y in the second equation gives us x times x minus 2 equals 4. And multiplying, we have x squared minus 2x equals 4. Now, I've left space here because I can complete the square pretty readily in order to solve. Taking half of negative 2, which is negative 1, and squaring it, which is 1, I add 1 to both sides of the equation. And that gives me x minus 1 squared equals 5. Now, using the principle of square roots, I would have x minus 1 equals the square root of 5, or x minus 1 equals the opposite of the square root of 5. And adding 1 to both sides gives me x equals 1 plus the square root of 5, or x equals 1 minus the square root of 5. And remember, we only needed to solve for x, so we're done, and we can state this a little bit more clearly, or succinctly, I guess, saying that x is 1 plus or minus the square root of 5.